Let's choose a rare card. Corpse Explosion. Easy. Yeah, so I think that situation there is... The first turn was where I messed up. I should have... I should have, um... Twin Strikes and then killed him on that following turn and hopefully the potion saves me. But it is what it is. I, I'm gonna have to be forced to take a shot here because the other path is just not, not good. So we're gonna have to just like, an empty shop. It is what it is. I can't avoid it. Runs are going fantastic. The run, the run wasn't bad last run. I, I think I may, might have messed up the first turn. But we, we ended up eventually losing. We, we lost. We also had a couple of that did nothing, yep. Salem is one wonder, isn't he? No, Salem is uh, California. Yeah, we, we had a late start today. I gotta move the chat. The chat box is looking kind of... We gotta lower this, actually. One sec. Chat box doesn't get in your way, guys? It, was, it wasn't like this before, right? No, but like, was it always like this? Cause I'm on a new setup, so it's it, it's different. Let me let me fix something. You're dizzy. Now, what are we doing here? Bane because of course explosion? Probably not. Probably not. This is kind of a weird option. I might have to skip here. Sorry, that was that's you weren't hallucinating. That's that that was a swing switch. Feels bad not taking any cards. Time to go insane, I guess. Ooh, okay, we got poison going. Okay, we dodged an accuracy. Feels good. Okay, so this is a toughie because... Hmm. This is a toughie. Alright, what's the best way to save life? I could take six, or I could take... Two damage. Like, all my good cards I drew in the first turn. Just find out we're getting your new house, so we can move in just... Oh, awesome, dude. Great news. Now, whether or not that I take more damage in the long run is another story. No, this is the second one. I'm not like I'm not that upset about the, f the first one. The first one was fine. It's all good. I might have messed up that fight, but yeah, I'm not upset about my decisions. Take a poison stab. Okay, I got another shop. That's a little bit. Unfortunate. A little unfortunate because I have no gold, so shops are the least impactful. I suppose we could take a backflip. 
But even then, backflip right now with three energy is not that great. Back when I first played this game, I was like, take as many backflips as possible. And when you're on ascension zero or one, that's totally viable. But I think here it's not as good. That's another empty shop. Damn. Damn. The silent one yesterday? Which one, which one was that? I don't even remember. We have great AOE and great tools. We just, in Act 1, they're a little bit awkward with the energy that we have. Pro works fantastic. All right, this is a great upgrade. Hell yes. It depends on who the fight is. We do footwork because we already have. Okay, so now we get to redeem ourselves. We get to redeem ourselves here. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Ow. Fuck. I mean, this is fine because we have... We have Fairy in the bottle. If you don't wanna see me... Oh my god. Early Toxic Egg. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. So this would be a second Crippling Cloud Plus. Fischetz is very good, but I have too many attacks at the moment. Crippling Cloud is very strong. If I get like Snekawai or just an Energy Relic, Act 2 is looking amazing. We gotta make sure we survive Act 1. Fairy in the Bottle helps get, get us there. Yes, yesterday never happened. Yesterday we were just testing out a different time slot, you know, getting the mojo going for, um... Getting the mojo going for like late night streams, you know. All right, second crippling plus, but we definitely want to start looking at. Do we ever rest here? So we don't have to waste fairy the bottle. Like we have a lot of upgrades. So what if we just start resting? Use the bathroom real quick. But I can see a world in which resting is fine. I'm gonna go for another elite. Bear back. All right, let's go. I mean, if I use fairy, yeah, then if I use fairy sooner, we can get tropic. That's 100 percent true. So we are wasting in tropic at the moment. So we can let fairy go right now. We have a, didn't we have a run on YouTube? Did I put it on YouTube where basically I got like three fairies in a row and I was just using it and it carried me through Act 1 or Act 2? Like, it was actually insane. We just got fairy, fairy, fairy. And it was the only reason we, we stayed alive. I'm okay with using fairy now. But we don't know what the potion we're going to get is going to be a good one. Would I dump uh, Entropic for another fairy? Hmm. Possibly, yeah. Entropic's not that... It's not like... That amazing. I can, I can take no damage, but I can also just start... Mm. There's slimes. I'll do that. That's probably better. Traffic's not that good when I get a potion each combat. Ooh. 
Ooh, deadly poison. Get some poggy woggies going. What the fuck is going on? Wait, what? <laughs> um, <clears throat> excuse my French. Strength pot. Strength pot is probably just better than Entropic, to be honest. Like Entropic, with Fairy, I, so Entropic is just not that good when I have White Beast and I also hold on to Fairy. We're just testing, yep, just testing. Yesterday's test paid off. We're just using chats off? Okay, let's fix this. Might be too small, let me know. It's important that we get Little Miss Corpse Explosion going on. I still haven't used Fairy. I like Tiny Chest. I like Blur. Hell yeah. So if we're going to upgrade something, it's probably going to be... Mm, Neutralize is not as good when I already have two Crippling Clouds, right? Crippling Clouds is... This is probably the better upgrade. Alright, let's go. Alright, so are we just callousing now? We're trying to get we're trying to get closer for the second phase. If we catalyst now, we can prevent damage, keep the fairy for one more time, and then Okay, let's say we do we actually let the fairy proc and we do catalyst now. Alright. So we take the hit and try to milk the poison even more. And then after this, we can like do fire pot and just kick his ass. So let's say this try to make a really good split. Real quick, okay. He's at ninety four right now. Eighty two. I have too much damage. So I can just split him now with all this damage that I have, or I can put him just on the edge. I can put him at 76. So this, this puts him at 76, and then the turn after, I do fire putt. It's probably better, right? a waste of blur. It sucks. It's a waste of blur. I 
I don't even get to use Corpse Explosion here. I don't think we're dead. What's funny is that I can prevent the weaken. I can I can block and prevent the weaken from here. And kill that and then take two damage and then next turn I I, I strike this flag slime. This guy doesn't attack twice, does he? But this guy's gonna attack next turn. So if I kill this guy now, and I take two damage, then this guy's probably not gonna attack next turn, and then this guy I can just full smack him. I wanna prevent the weaken. You know what I mean? Well, he's attacking again. Oh. That was unfortunate. Yeah, they attack. They, they can attack twice in a row. So we got Bullet Time Phantasmal Grand Finale. Well, I think Bullet Time's pretty good. Like, I can't. We have two corpse explosions. So we, so we have two creeping clouds and a corpse explosion. Like there's turns where we want to play more than we can, right? Snake away all the time. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. <clears throat> and we have a lot of corpses and clouds and yep there's a lot of upgrades and one elite which you don't really need upgrades um or there's a lot of elites two elites to be exact and a shop over here there's three elites is this a three elite deck like first off we should probably take a look at the question marks because we do want to maybe get tiny chest so if we go this path we get a relic here because of tiny chest. We get the sparkle out of the way, and then we fight three elites. At least against Stabby Boy. We have a lot of poison and catalysts. Although I'm not hitting the shop there, that's the only problem. Jesus Christ. Stick's out of control already. Oh my lord. Backflip and bullet time? Toxic egg is disgusting. Alright, so we get a chemical X here. And bouncing flask is pretty good when I have Sneko Eye, right? And bullet time. Because on average it just does a lot of uh, a lot of poison for a cheap amount. Secret technique is pretty good, so you can pull out the things you need to get, like catalysts in a pinch, corpse explosion in a pinch, bullet time if you need it. So secret technique is pretty nice, but it's also at the same time not very consistent with the cost. Okay, so chemical X doesn't do anything right now, and I can't really take it hoping I get my laser or something. So I think we just take footwork number two and remove.
Footwork number two and remove. Seems fine. Do we want bouncing though? I mean, bouncing is not bad with Sneko Eye. Absolutely not bad. We also have just a crap ton of poison as it is though. We already have two crippling of corpse deadly and a catalyst. So like But I don't even I think there's another shop definitely in the future. I think we can get to these elites without buying bouncing. But it definitely just increases the overall crazy amount of poison. Uh yeah. You know, I, I'm, I'm, I, honestly, I'm curious to play around with it more on Sneko. Hmm. Predator is great, but I want a weekend right now. Too much damage. Was that lethal? I don't think it was lethal. Move neutralize is good? Uh, not typically, no. In this situation with, with Sneko Eye, it's a consideration, perhaps, yeah. Mm -hmm. You get some sustain. Ooh, ooh. Let's just get the gold. I could also just leave, to be honest, instead of being greedy, boy. Adrenaline's awkward. I wish I had blur here. Yeah, in this particular deck, I think that's something to be considered 100%. 100% can consider that in this deck. Uh, what if I just do Ghost now? Well, Ghost is only protecting me for 12 damage. It's protecting me for 12 damage. It could probably protect me for a lot more in these elite fights, right? Imagine like a slaver fight. Ghost could protect me for upwards of 40. Yeah, but here's the thing. Like this ghost and could save me for the next fight. For a lot more damage. Shrink doesn't do anything on that turn. We don't need all this. Like, Deadly Poison Plus, it's. No, we don't need it. I mean. We don't need it. We see more block. Catalyst right now. I mean, I want to get a bigger catalyst, but this is not that bad to be honest. Oh my lord. Disgusting. Absolutely gross. Oh, whoa. Oh, hecko, sneko, sneko. Dodge and roll is great with double footwork. And we get a relic right here because of sneko. I mean, because of tiny chests. 
Matryoshka. Oh, baby. All right, guys. I'm going to sit back, relax, and take this one to the bank. Hi. That's awesome, dude. Hell yes. Crazy run. I want to save some of these. Callus wins. I didn't have coffee today. I need coffee, guys. Oh, we got singing bowl. Yes. Perfect. Actually, right, so the courier. Everything is 20% reduced, and we get restocked. I I really like the courier. You got me. Pre-recorded. Uh, Sapphire, though, I, I want to get it out of the way. I mean, there's a shop coming up, and Courier's, I think it's pretty good. What is this key worthy? What's up, uh, Hendo? How you doing, man? Mm, to key or not to key? We're going to remove, we're most likely just removing. I like this. Oh boy. Disgusting. Absolutely filthy. Filthy, filthy, filthy. I don't want I don't really want to touch anything because if I like the the bigger the deck that becomes the less often I get bullet time first turn right oh my okay well here's the thing piercing wall plus is very good in a deck predator with snake away allows me to do bullet time shenanigans that more often because predator it allows me to just shuffle through my deck nine cards when I play it right and then Bullet time is seen more often. So Predator is looking really juicy, but I don't want to blow because the turn ones are often really good the way they are just as is. And then Piercing Wheel Plus is just fantastic. Yeah, Piercing Wheel is probably fine for the champ. To have in the bag against the champ, absolutely. Or against anything that's coming on. I think it's a ready draw, 7 draw, I agree. I was going to upgrade something. Let's get turn of recalling. Catalyst now. I should take energy pot. That was my bad. I should get rid of this and do energy pot. That was my bad. Not that it matters, actually. It's game over. I 
like that. Ooh, leg sweep is pretty good thing to add to the deck. I cannot complain there. Ooh, start with an artifact. That's pretty juicy. But I'm probably just going to remove a strike here. Absolutely removing a strike. And Noxious Fumes, I don't think you think is necessary. Because it makes Awaken 1 harder for no reason. And we already have Crippling Clouds. So... I think we just pass here. <laughs> yeah, Booker Stadion gets destroyed in this deck. No, we don't need to do any of this. Save that money for another shop because Courier is going to give us good value later on. This fight's over. Neutralize is still useful. Neutralize is still useful. Entropic. Get Rex, you could have a Kato. We could just do a big speed pot blur right now. Why not? Okay, so what we want to do is like... Okay, we want to do Catalyst. I think we, we can't really one-shot with Catalyst, can we? That's the problem. That's the problem, but I think... Like, this is getting close, right? Because if we draw into Bullet Time, and draw into Bullet Time and Catalyst, then this is looking really good. Well, I have potions every single fight, so I don't really care about... I don't really care about the potions I, I use. Here we want to. I want to do poison, but don't. I don't want the poison to kill him right now. Like I don't want him to split him, so I'm gonna do this. And now Kalash will be perfect. Kalash just wins the fight. Right, GG. Oh my god. You can't be serious with these options. This is a YouTube video. Each card is a YouTube video. Each card. So, in Venom, Snake of Skull. It's not good for this deck, but you know, it's, it's always nice. Okay, Nightmare Plus is so insane. Because you can Nightmare the Footwork, the Blur, the Catalyst. And Bullet Time is just it's so proactive. Every single turn. The more bullet times you have, the more you're playing. Yeah, but Sneko and Venom is bad here because we don't we're never striking, we're just doing other things. But the the nightmare is like it could be bullet time or it could be anything else. It's just insane. Runic Pyramid. Now this is how you def okay. If I take the second bullet time, Runic Pyramid is the play. But since I didn't do that, you definitely don't touch Runic Pyramid. Alright? Let's go. But the title of the YouTube video, Jer. What's up, Blah? How you doing? It's going well, buddy. Uh, let's go for some elites. Two elites? Three, three elites. And we get tiny chest value. And we get tiny chest value. This is a build that you uh, don't show your mother built. That's what it is. Do not show your mother. Okay, so 
we crippling cloud is a perfect nightmare target here we also new bullet time for the fight but this is just a good target for nightmare Unbelievable. Corp Explosion wins. Who's the lucky target? You are. Look at memories. Is it better than Energy Pot? Uh, damn. All these potions, I don't know what to do with it. Max HP. Oh, I really kind of want the regret because that gold with the courier goes a long way. The only problem is... I don't have a shop in sight. Fuck it. No, I mean, also, you never know, like, what the, uh... You never know what the, what's it called? Question marks are gonna give you, but... No, this is fine. Hi. So, this, this is game over? This is disgusting, guys. It's ridiculous. Too much power. Backflip is just really good. I don't think backflip floats. We could we could do nightmare footwork. Or we wanna just crazy poison him. Let's just do this, why not? Yeah, no reason to race, exactly. I agree. Twelve dexterity, no problem. I see you gave me twelve damage every turn, so I got twelve dexterity to counteract it. And if we nightmare blur in a fight, if necessary, out of control. Wally plans is pretty good. Is it considered bloaty? Are we? Does it consider bloaty bloaty for doing this? Ooh, man! Sometimes the RNG gods—they love to gift you all the things. I meant to put poison on her. Uh, whoopsies. I messed that up. Oh, nightmare. I can get to use you. Uh, 
Golden Sun would be nice here. Or not. Take a step back real quick. Let me think about this one. Let me think about this one. I don't even know. Is it even good? Is that even good? One second. I think that would just blow my deck. I think it just blows the deck, right? Because, well, oh, whoa. At what point do we say we want to let's not do another Crippling Cloud deck? We don't need it, right? The deck is working perfectly fine. Dead Bridge will only from catalysts, crippling clouds, mm, it's probably necessary. I can't believe I'm gonna skip the dead branch. Unbelievable, wow, that's a title. Deck so strong, you skip dead branch. What's up, what's up Vitality? Taking damage. Oh no. Should we go for perfects or we don't care? I don't care. You see what I'm seeing? Okay. I think Kadia's here, yeah. I'm thinking I wanted a survivor, something I want to play with little memories, right? So, like, I'm thinking of survivor crippling cloud for the weekend. So, I want to take less damage. How much damage are we taking right now if I weaken him? I guess I could also just do Crippling Cloud and Liquid Memories the Nightmare. Well, we, should, we should probably prioritize full block though, right? Because the fight's not going to be lost. We should probably prioritize full block. This is annoying. Yeah, Nightmare Kalash just wins the fight, but I want to pro protect my life a little bit. I'm fighting two elites right after this. Like, I don't need a rush at all. <clears throat> Although, it would be nice to, to use Crippling Cloud. He does like 28 damage with Crippling Cloud. I'm taking damage regardless, huh? Now we're cooking with gas. 
I want you guys to feel the gas that we're about to cook with. All right. This is gas. This is what dreams are made of. Dreams are made of gas. Only eat a lot of beans. Who rigged this run? I'm sorry guys, look, it doesn't always happen, all right? It doesn't always happen. I'm gonna, I'm gonna high roll here, watch. I lied, fuck. Oh, you can't see the seat? Yeah, let me move that. I'll share the love. Oh, shit. Air thanks for the Twitch Prime, buddy. Welcome back, man. How you doing? How you been? I swear I was like 3,300 plus. I, I don't know exactly. Carrying these Aram games? I, I, I'm a fan of Aram as well. I feel like I'm the only one. Bullet time. Should I wait for Nightmare Catalysts? Absolutely. At this point, he just dies without Nightmare Callus, but let's wait for Nightmare Callus anyways. Yeah, three cost Callus, whatever. I mean, it's just guaranteed lethal no matter what. Because uh, we can draw into bullet time, watch. Uh, we won't draw to bullet time, but we, we have a guaranteed lethal. Next turn. And we just gonna try collecting ghosts in the jars, that's what we need. Let's try giving me ghosts in the jars. Uh, I guess I. I could rest and then recall. I could do a whole bunch of crap. Whoa, bottle lightning, so don't we always want to bottle bullet time? Now there's also the world in which you're bottling nightmare and trying to get a big nightmare early on in the fight, but you probably always want to bottle bullet time, right? There's also consideration for blur or Corpion Cloud. I think bullet time is always a nice thing to bottle here. Nightmare will come. So I don't even need these campfires. So why just go to the events, right? Because we get, no, we don't get tiny chests, but. What is it to upgrade? I guess neutralize, what else? That's it? That's not worth upgrading. So let's go for more fights. Okay, I can't do that because Courier for the Act 4 shop, right? 
This is a really good relic, but I can't do it. Damn. Too much gold. So is there a world where we're just uh, nightmaring the... All the time? No, we're not. Also, I'm pretty sure we already figured this out, but Nightmare only retains the cost of what it was pre-bullet time, right? <clears throat> Nightmare's just bad here. Nightmare Piercing Whale. Well. I mean, Nightmare just didn't have anything here. Every bullet time is fine. Absolutely fine. The more bullet times in that deck, the better. It's gonna feel awkward here, but after the fact, it's gonna feel amazing. Number two would probably worth it. I guess I can go into this with full life. We have region pot though. Let's just do this. Mega crate is responsible for this. We found the corpse explosion. Now we just catalyst him and we win. I should have played. I should have played while playing. Whoopsies. That was a mistake he picked. One second. Uh, I don't have energy here. I wanted to Crippling Cloud because the weak is so good. I don't necessarily have to rush. I have two Catalysts in the deck. I don't gotta rush. Ridiculous. <laughs> okay. One of my corpse explosion. Also, for this fight. I'm probably playing footwork. 100%. Catalyst right now just to buy time and save the second catalyst for the second phase. Or are we trying to do damage here for crippling corp explosion? Not wasting that though. Should have done on the bigger guy because the bigger guy. Never. Okay, never punished. I 
good number for work, but it's just fine. Take care you can destroy this fire completely. Took all time before I took Snickle, yep. Wait, what was the... Yeah, I took bullet time, because it was between bullet time... Bullet time plus, um, and I forgot what the other two options were. They weren't that great. Is it even worth doing full work now, though? I took Adrenaline? No, no, no. Oh, it was Adrenaline. Yeah, it was adrenaline. Yeah, you're right, you're right. Grand finale, bullet time. Well, actually, I think it was adrenaline. I don't even know. It's turned into blur. Venom, that's what it was. That was the second, I think that's the second reward though. Blur stacks. Never heard of Blurricade? Wait, this guy's never heard of the Blurricade. Uh, guys, we gotta help him. Guys, sh you gotta tell him what's good. Unaware. Basically, yeah, barricade, yep. Yep, that's why Nightmare Blur is really it's a big win condition. I wasted my Sundown. Should I? I can't. I can't do anything about it. GG. You know, I could have went for a higher score. That's really good going into Act 4, guys. A really good score going into Act 4. I could have got a higher score by perfecting Nemesis, but I, I decided to go against it. This could have been a high score run, actually. If I focused on it. I could have done the Nemesis perfect. Right, we have a lot of gold for this. Unbelievable. Okay, Panagraph is just unnecessary because I'm not going to need it. But we are going to remove a strike. We could do max HP. Want to go for max HP? Like, we could do 10 max HP. Or just remove a card. Yeah, if you're hitting 2400, going to act for 2400 plus, you're... 10 max HP versus removing a strike. I don't need any of this though. The strike is just so much better to remove. Um, I guess we could buy a potion. A thorn pot's not bad, right? Get more damage. It's a discount mango, 100%. I don't need strength pot though, right? Fire pot might be better for this elite, just to kill the elite. Or just, I think, let's do, let's do this, easy. Let's go. If I get Nightmare, uh, GG. All right. So we can Nightmare Blur, right? And Blur is free. Or we can Nightmare Footwork. We already like Blurricade as it is, right? 
Let's use one of these power pots real quick. Get rid of the artifacts there. Maybe a nightmare blur. Let's see, you can move some artifacts here. It's GG. Fight's over. Fight is over. Over. Oh my lord, I'm mercy. Ginger. That one was really good, but I think we don't need it. <clears throat> Waste crack. Ginger's okay, whatever. We're not really using strikes anyways. Um, Turnip would've been great. Shuriken and Ginger are not really useful. I think Dodger was really good for the full works, but we'd rather not blow and have Blur more often, right? I think Blurricade is really the best way to go. After Image? Why not? Get one Kalos going right now. Keep our damage going. We have Nightmare Footwork. Nightmare Catalyst. Okay, Nightmare Footwork just wins the fight. Nightmare Catalyst gives me enough poison that he just dies in four turns. We perfected everything, but I didn't protect that one Nemesis I could have. But uh, we neutralize this mitigates a whole bunch of damage. Um. So number Catalyst gets all the poison going, but we have so much poison, so we just do number fork, and then we want to neutralize. Fishing will be great here. We found it. I meant to play footwork first, but I should have done block pot then footwork. That's my bad. I can still do it if I get lucky. Hmm. I, I could play that better actually. Yeah, I could have played that better. Play footwork first, play block pot footwork first, and then maybe see what I hit. Yeah, I'm going for perfects. Like, I could just wield now. I'm not gonna need it in the future, right? It could say it could help me in the future though. Because we now have blur kid. We, we have footwork shenanigans. So maybe I should keep this and do block pot now. I think. Yeah, I think so. Keeping Prism out helps me get a perfect in the future. I'm looking for bullet time. I'm not really utilizing these footworks properly. We want bullet time for them. We don't have block. I should just let these free shuffle to be honest. I 
Because she, I'm actually, I can't, I can't get perfect, I don't think. There's a chance I get perfect if I draw into a zero cost bullet time. I'm not scared, I just think I'm trying to get perfect. You think I'm gonna draw into a zero cost bullet time? But even that's not perfect. I'm not getting perfect here. Easy food sign. Since you're not getting perfect. Hit this line. It's hilarious. It's actually hilarious. <laughs> All right. I want to play these goddamn footworks. I want to get this out of the deck. Yeah, no perfect, it sucks. Maybe I can play it better. GG! We did it! Alright, no perfect, but we did it! Or whatever, I'm, I'm over here bunched by perfect, but this run was insane! It's all good. GG! This is the turn I was looking for. This would have given me the perfect. Teach. I predict three thousand. Three thousand. Three thousand four hundred. Three thousand four hundred. Three thousand three hundred seven.